Hi everyone, today we're going to prepare pork belly. Andrew always jokes that whenever I cook, I can't resist putting something Asian into my cooking. Well, I am 60% Asian and I can prove that. When you have a look at this photo of my grandfather, he looks pretty Asian, and my grandmother. And we're, we're uh, going to have some pork belly today. He used to be a pork farmer, and so we're gonna make this dish in honor of him. It's gonna be a very easy dish, but we have to start preparing in the morning. It's in the morning, I've got my pajamas on, um, but it's only going to take about five minutes to prepare this dish. What I do is I organize the pork belly on a little rack here, over the sink and what we're going to do is we're going to pour some boiling hot water straight from the kettle onto the pork and so this is about two litres one and a half litres of boiling water and I'm just simply going to pour it over the pork belly and so it's scalding the skin and I'm going to use all of the kettle. Once you've poured all of that hot water on the pork belly just get some paper towel and you dry the skin. Once you've get, got, gotten rid of all that um, excess moisture, just get a ceramic dish and get any old jar marinade. This is a Korean pork marinade. And what I've done is I've spread it on the bottom of this dish nice and evenly, and the pork belly is going to sit in this dish. And it's gonna sit in this dish flesh down. So it's really important not to get the skin wet and just place the pork in the marinade as such and then put this uncovered into the fridge until we start to cook it. It's been a couple of hours now and our pork belly has been in the fridge uh, during the day. So if we come a little bit closer, we're just about to put some salt onto the pork belly and we're going to rub it into the skin. Now I'm only taking about a half a teaspoon and I'm just sprinkling this on to the skin. I don't want to use too much salt because you'll just get really, really salty skin. And I'm just rubbing it in there, rubbing it in. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this pork belly out and you see it's been marinating in the marinade for all that time and I'm just going to put it in a paper lined baking dish, dish and stick it in the oven and the oven's only at low about 150 degrees Celsius fan force. Okay so it's been about an hour the pork's been in the oven I'm just going to pull it out now and the last time we checked its temperature it was 45 degrees and I'm going to get my trusty temperature probe, my trusty thermometer and you can see it's above 71, 75 so this is cooked, this is ready to go and you can see what's happened to the salt, the salt's sort of like encrusted etc etc but there's no crackling so what I've done is I have put the grill on low and I'm going to stick the pork belly in until it starts to crackle it's going to be probably about 10-15 oh, minutes before it comes out of the grill we have Place the pork belly in the griller for about 15 minutes, 20 minutes uh, to crackle up the skin. And you can come and have a look here and you can see what has happened to it. And uh, it looks pretty crunchy. And we're going to cut it up and see how crunchy that actually is. And you can hear that crunch. Yeah. Um. Haru Haruki, where is your... Fingers, quick, pick it up, taste it. What's it like? Mmm, delicious. So tasty. This is the end, beautiful friend. This is the end.